Oh, noon scary moments for people out just trying to have a good time over the weekend. Police say two people were shot when a gun went off in Fort Lauderdale. CBS 4's Ted Scott is live at the scene with the latest. Ted. Hi, Maribel. Well, this happened about 3 o'clock in the morning on Sunday uh, here on Southwest 2nd Street, just west of downtown Fort Lauderdale. The good news is that no one suffered any life-threatening injuries. However, this afternoon, one person is in custody in connection with this case. Mr. Harris is before the court on one charge of aggravated battery with a deadly weapon. Urban Harris makes his first court appearance. He's accused of shooting two people early Sunday morning. It happened on Southwest 2nd Street in Fort Lauderdale's Himmershe Village Entertainment District. Witnesses say it happened after they saw several men arguing. Police say Harris did not have a permit while carrying a concealed weapon into a bar. Prosecutors pushed for a higher bond. It's alleged Mr. Harris, and this is according to multiple independent witnesses, Mr. Harris brought a loaded firearm into a club, armed himself, brandished the firearm, and then when he was trying to be disarmed by other witnesses, the firearm discharged, striking two victims. One person was shot in the knee. The other was a witness who was shot in the pinky. Harris's defense attorney said this is the first felony charge Harris is facing and that he didn't actually fire the gun intentionally. And by reading the PC, you see that he didn't shoot the gun. It went off during a struggle. And we're asking the bond be reduced to $10,000. Now, prosecutors were asking for a $21,000 bond. The defense asking for a total of $11,000. The judge granted that $11,000 bond, saying if he does get out, though, he cannot come back to this area and he cannot have a gun. Live in Fort Lauderdale, Ted Scout, CBS 4 News.